Hello to all my Capricorns out there. This is the new moon energy. Let's see what we have going on today for this new moon. Let's see, Capricorn. I'm going to use my Angels and Ancestors Oracle deck. Yes, Capricorn. Spirit Ancestors. Show me the cards I need to see for Capricorn. Let's ground for all the Capricorns. Show me the cards I need to see for Capricorns. What message does the Capricorns need to hear? Any cross washers? What is for the Capricorns though? Because I'm here for the cats. What message do we have for the Capricorns? What's crowning this reading today for the Capricorns and the new moon? New moon energy. And not your passions. Follow your heart. You, you're, you are in indecision about something. Follow your heart. Follow your heart. I have some intuitive messages that are coming to me. Yes. This, this is for somebody that is in indecision. They're like weighing their options. They're like, they know what they can do. They have, they're very talented. This is definitely for somebody that has tattoos. This person has tattoos or a tattoo, but I feel like they have more than one. You're a very caring person. You are. You help your family, but you still have some inner, inner demons to work out. You, your, your anxiety. Oracle, you're waiting for something important. There's something important coming to you. Some information you don't even may not even know that you're going to receive. But you're going to be receiving some important information coming. Yes. Um, believe in yourself, magic guardian. Unlock the magic within you. We all have our own magic. And that doesn't mean spell work and all of that. Because all of that is not necessary. It's not. Because the universe takes care of its own. Just living your true purpose. Unlock the magic within. And the last one is stag. Trust and thrive. Trust in this. Because I feel like at the beginning, you're in indecision about a decision that you need to make. But you know that you have what it takes. You're very professional. You have the skills. This is somebody that is very skilled. You have the skills. You, you know that you have it. Yeah, this person definitely has some type of tattoos. I'm getting that, like, double. And you're very caring. Like, you're very caring. You're, you're, you'll you help out, and you'll get somebody your last dollar. But you still also have a lot of inner demons that you're trying to cover up. Instead of covering up, let them out and deal with them. Believe in yourself, because you can do it. You can do it! Believe in yourself. You can definitely do it. Watch the people around you. Definitely see a couple of snakes around you. Watch those people. Shed those people that you no longer, that are no longer serving you and they're not seeing you for who you are because you know who you are. Let's put some tarot on it. For the Capricorns. With clarity and third eye stones. Clarity for the Capricorn, for the Capricorns, please and thank you, spirit. Let's get some clarity for the Capricorn. Please and thank you, Spirit. Clarity for the Capricorn. Yes. I don't know, y'all. Sometimes I just like singing everything. Oh, I wanted to come out. The sun, the greatest card in all tarot. You have what it takes. Success. Whenever you get out of this indecision in your head, whenever you stop doubting yourself, all of that, you're going to gain clarity. You're going to be successful. You're going to be prosperous. You're going to achieve your goals. You're going to receive good news. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, for the Capricorn. But guess what? You have a karmic. Let me try to stop singing. I can't help y'all. Anyway, there's a karmic here. 
there's a karmic here that's very misguided. They they want to, they're very, a very ignorant person. Um, maybe this was a third party situation. I'm not sure. Um, but this is a, somebody that has a secret agenda. They're very superficial. They think about money and what they, you can give to them. Um, you need to listen to your inner voice about this person. It, because money ain't shit at the end of the day. This person loves to avoid responsibilities. They're taking on too much. And then whenever they, they tell you that they can handle all this, they're buckling whenever it's too much. They just want to give up. But they're acting like they can handle it when they're not. They, they can't. We also have the Five of Cups. You're getting acceptance with this situation. You're forgiving yourself. You're moving on. Because you feel like you were stuck with this karmic, but you're not. The Two of Wands in reverse. You are fearing the unknown. You, you, you are very indecisive, holding back. You didn't plan things out too well. Maybe this is just like a situation where, take it how it resonates, um, where you didn't intend for this for you to be with this person for so long. You thought that this was just going to be a temporary situation and it ended up turning into a long period of time. Next, we have the Ten of Pentacles. Yes. When, whenever you realize your, your worth and this karmic is out of your mind and out of, out of your headspace, you have the Ten of Pentacles right beside the sun, baby. You have the Ten of Pentacles, you have wealth, you have happiness, achievement, prosperity. Yeah, you might be investing in some properties. Six of Cups. Six of Cups. There's some, some innocence behind a situation. Um, goodwill, past returning. You might have a reunion with somebody from your past coming up. It doesn't have to be uh, love necessarily. It could be uh, somebody that just... It's going to be somebody good, like an old friend or... Anything of that nature. It could be new love, but somebody from your past, maybe from school. It doesn't have to be, but it's, it's somebody from your past for sure. I'm proud of you. You have the sun. You have the sun. Wow. The devil. But it's in reverse. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing. We have the devil in reverse. You're breaking free from this that no longer serves you. This, this, this. Um, so there might be more than one karmic because I've seen uh, two karmics, two karmics, two karmics maybe here. I'm not sure. It may be a family member with one in a relationship with other. It's somebody that no longer serves you. You know who these people are. This person is impatient. They, they want to abuse their power. They want to dominate you. They want to put you through shit that like they, they want to make you doubt yourself. But this devil is in reverse, baby. And you're breaking free from that shit. But you do still fear the the unknown. And you just st still need the, the plan. And, and you have a page of swords, which is in reverse. You have somebody that in your past, one of these karmics that was all about all talk. They talked. They gave you so many promises. They told you this, this, and this. We're going on a vacation here. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Oh, I'm planning the future with you undelivered it was all talk it was no action it was lies it was lies it was lies it's lies and then whenever you try to go back and talk to this person hey didn't you say we're gonna do this this and this they try to act like you was damn crazy and, and but oh yeah no you know they thought they knew every damn thing but at the end of the day they tried to play you and you're 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 waking it up to this they ended up they gonna end up realizing that they done fucked up the worst they done did the worst they should have never tried to play you because all that karma's coming back. And you're opening that third eye, baby. And you realize that you are love. Self-love is very important. You realize that you need to love yourself first and you have better things coming because you have the sun. Yes, yes, success, 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 success. All right, y'all. Thank you, Capricorns, for watching. Don't forget to get your energy into this channel and like, comment, and subscribe. As always, peace, love, namaste.